Alright ladies and gentlemen, this is it. This is the finale of Sonic Adventure. And we're gonna be starting off this part where of course where we go where we left off from every story. Alright. Uh that's where the well the it picks off where big story had left off. Is uh cut the uh the uh the tornado two is crashed, but why is the why is it the angel island is falling in the ocean once again? Has Knuckles already Knuckles has already uh, re 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 formed the master emeralds, but something doesn't seem right. Oh, Eggman! Guess why he's gonna rat on Sonic. I knew it. Because you're the baddie in this game, you egg belly slime ball. What's master plan? It's probably gonna be four before you actually succeed, as always. Chaos! Eggman. Oh dear. Yeah, all right, we're back on Angel Island. And Knuckles seems to be feed the master seed, emerald uh, is where it belongs. Seen the fall of Angel Island, but Angel Island is still falling. This doesn't make any sense. It doesn't. But what I wonder Maybe. what happened? Why he has all the chaos emeralds by it? Those chaos emeralds that I brought back with me. Maybe yeah, it might be something to do with it. Something to do with what's happening. I'll take them to Sonic for his advice. Good idea, Knuckles. But uh oh, I think he's witnessed something. It's Eggman again. Eggman. And but this time he doesn't seem to be up to no good. He must be in trouble now. This is terrible. Chaos is. Is what? What is going on? And when you get to see chaos, and he's gonna attack Knuckles as much as he did with Eggman. All right, and we're back at the main area where the train station is. And oh, Sonic's taking a nap. Another nap. <laughs> what the? Yes, Eggman learned his lesson. What the? Yes. His fingers clipping with his mouth. <laughs> Great work, Sonic, Sonic team. Great work. Oh, his head keeps clipping over it. Hey there, Tails. Did you find the tornado too? Oh dear. Never mind that. Get up and follow me. What's up, ah, Tails? Angel Island is falling again. Hey, no way. What do you think you again? Well, I don't know, but we better hurry. <laughs> anyway, with that being said, come on, Sonic, let's get going. We need to uh, get. We need to get off to see what has happened. And with it, within that, well, with that being said, we are now back in control. Of Sonic once again, so of course his spin dash will make him get a big, tremendous speed boost, so we can get through to whatever is been going on. So, well, with that being said, let's go and see what just happened. Well, let's have a look, let's have a look at the, uh, the master world's fully restored, but Angel Island still crashed. But anyway, that being said, I think this is where Knuckles and Eggman have fallen. Oh dear. And the Eggmobile is nowhere to be seen. Sonic, uh, sorry. Knuckles and Eggman, what happened here? He stole my Chaos Emeralds and Chaos is still alive. What? He's, he's still alive? Ah, he's not going to get away with this. I my thoughts exactly, Eggman. Hey, Eggman, wait up! Let him, let him go off on his own. Sonic, we've got more important things to look at, beast. and I mean bad if news. If he gets that last Chaos Emerald, we're done for. It'll be no the end of the explain. world. We'll get on it. Tails, right? And of course, what? it's that fourth light again. Oh, jeez! Oh my God! Alright, Tio. This place. 
it looks familiar. And we're back on the Angel it's Islands again. It's not a dream after all. But unfortunately, it's the shrine again, and it's destroyed. Oh, guess what? Oh, this is what happens. This is what actually happens no between way. chaos. Did you hear what I said? I won't obey. We need those seven emeralds to give us total power. Greed. Freaking greed. Too, you know, we must get that emerald. Greed is our enemy. My soul puts exactly. Always want more. Please don't do this. I beg you. Why couldn't you I listen to your daughter, Pakakamak? Charge! What the? What on earth? That has got to be some bad animation. Oh no! And they knocked poor Tikau over. What have they done? They've. They're killing the Chow! You heartless bastards! Oh no, the seven Chaos Emeralds are flashing and going over the Master Emerald. It looks like Pakakamak and his men are going to find out the horrible truth. And it looks like Chaos is oh, on the Unleashed. No, it's the Guardian of the no! Chaos. It's the Guardian of the Chow. Oh my god. Uh, right, let's get this over, hey, shall we? Hey, are you alright? Uh, I think so. What has happened? Oh my gosh. No, no, no. And it's Chaos's, Chaos's sorrow that's happened. All thanks to Pakakamax meddling. Wait up! Uh, that is just really bad. Why did Pakakamax never listen to his daughter? Are the servers. Chaos is power enriched by the heart. The controller serves to unify the chaos. <gasps> and that is how uh, Tikal's. The seven emeralds can change our thoughts into power. If this emerald controls that power, please, you must stop him. And as a result of that, Takao is sealed in the Master Emerald. This is the re so that's the reason why he, she Sorry. is the uh, orb that follows us all around. And the guardian uh, of us all. I was on a snooze cruise, I guess. <laughs> Tails' reaction. Good thing you're okay. You just sort of conked out there. Oh, Tails. Knuckles left already. Come, we gotta go after the last emerald. If he gets that uh, last the emerald, it should still be on board the tornado too. And that's in the Mystic Ruins forests. So, if the chaos gets that, unfortunately, it's all over. Well, sort of. <laughs> All right, Sonic, let's get going, shall we? Oh, it's Aztec the music. It's great. Square will be departing well, soon. sadly, though, we're, that's, we're not going to go there just yet. We've got to find the Tornado 2. And I know where to go. And it's that big house. But unfortunately, I go there automatically when I get to the forest, which is Look, pretty much convenient, too. I guess. Yeah, so let's get the Chaos Emerald and leave. But then, suddenly, what? And he gets it. He actually snatched it. No, he's got the last emerald. Oh shit! Now what do we do? Oh God, help us all! This is what happens. This wasn't the actual opening. Whenever you actually, this was act. This was the same cutscene that happens during the entire when it, when you actually uh, start the game off. This is kind of like the opening cutscene whenever you start boot up this game, but it's more extended. It contains some scenes that weren't seen. Especially some, some of these parts. Uh oh, that manhole cover's gonna move. Uh oh. 
All those manholes are gone. It looks like water's gushing out. Roads are getting cracked. Oh my god. And now the whole entire area has been is gonna be flooded because the whole all the water all the buildings are being uh, destroyed by water. And there's a massive wave over this which floods Station Square. And unfortunately all the citizens managed to get out in time and it's just all the citizens managed to get out in time. Oh my goodness gracious me. And there we go. There is chaos. Oh yeah. There he is. The fearsome beast himself. For all the citizens are probably the fastest thing alive now because of how they evacuated the city. Oh my god. If I wasn't just dreaming, that monster is a real menace. No shit, Sherlock. Uh oh. Eggman. Eggman's back. And is that another egg carrier he's rebuilt is built or is it a rebuilt Looks egg like carrier he's one? Chaos two. This egg carrier two was made because something like this could happen. You have defied your master, stupid beast. Now you must be destroyed at all costs. Now before what uh, before Eggman does anything, there we go, and it destroys it with one laser blast. Oh dear. Eggman just absolutely being obliterated with one blast. The Egg Carry 2 is just not done in a great way. Design flaw. Ah! See you later, Egg Face. I've had enough. Who do you think you are anyway? He's certainly not the king of the world. Oh, it's you. The one who sealed chaos in the master. Oh. Tikal. And we get to see the Echidna herself. There she is, Tikal. My heart has always been in the Master Emerald along with Chaos's. Now he's filled with anger and sadness. And it's so bad. And if it goes on, he'll eventually destroy the world like he did before. And this is a real catastrophe. And unfortunately, he's had all the seven Chaos Emeralds, but then he chucks it everywhere because all the power has gone on it. All the powers have been drained of the energy. Look, he's absorbed the Emerald's power. He must be sealed in the Master Emerald now. The only thing to do is to actually get Supersonic, but that's going to be impossible. His heart will still remain in turmoil, and his anger just won't vanish. But without the Chaos Emerald's power, he'll just be trapped forever. That's not going to be happening. What choice do we have? But now, look, oh, Big's found one of the Emeralds. Tails has found one of them. And so has Knuckles. But I think Knuckles and Tails has a lot of them. Hey, Sonic! Amy? Amy. And why is Birdie pink? Here! What's the first emerald? Tails and Knuckles are there as well. Hey guys, what's up? Chaos only used the negative power of the emeralds. Oh dear. Sonic, you should be able to harness their real power. As much as I hate to admit it, I think Tails is right about this. So it looks like Sonic has one of the emeralds in front of his well. Sonic! Yeah, Sonic! 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 What's up with those chants? Oh yes! Sonic the Hedgehog has got seven emeralds in terms of friendship. And friendship is indeed magic, everybody. Oh yeah. Now with all the uh, positive energy of his friendship, it looks as though they might uh, restore the Chaos Emeralds' power. And with all seven emeralds, yes, here we are. Super Sonic is here. So supersonic. Why don't we just go and vanquish that big monstrous beast? And with that being said, we have time for the final boss of the game, Perfect Chaos. Ladies and gentlemen, this is what happens. And of course, 
ladies and gentlemen, we have to collect a lot of rings as possible and go and head on to Chaos. So this is what you do. Head on to Chaos with full speed. Once you do that, you'll hit him. He's got two phases. Both of them have require three hits to defeat. And of course, the reason why I love this boss fight is because of open your the main theme of this game, open your heart plays during this whole entire segment. Sometimes it can be hard because Chaos can actually try and uh, hold you back. But if that happens, try and take a few steps back so you can actually destroy him. First part isn't that hard, but the second part where it is a little bit more harder because there is a lot more stuff coming towards you, like energy blasts and of course, and of course, uh, and of course, whirlpools, huge water pools. The first part, I do love Lip Open Your Heart, which is probably one of my favourite Sonic main themes ever. We'll probably hear the whole theme when the credits start to roll. And you thought that was it, but no, we've got another, we've got another phase to go. This is phase two, the second half of Chaos. The second phase is a lot more harder, and you've got less rings to collect if you've got a lot of the, of the rings as well. The only way you can actually get in speed is to use the... Oh dear, now this is what happens. This gets annoying quite quickly. Ugh! For God's sake. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Ugh! I hate, I hate it when he does that. Because he'll only inconveniently just try to stop me. But, but whenever the tornadoes go, move to the right. Because this will definitely help. Out of all the Super Sonic battles I played, this is probably one of my favourites alongside Sonic Adventure 2's final battle and Sonic 06's, the one with uh, Solaris. Despite the fact that game was uh, not too good. Oh, goodness gracious me, I have to gain more speed. Ugh, I just got sidetracked. Come on, Sonic. You need more speed. Ugh. I can't go back, so that means I have to, uh, I have to go for it. What happens if you don't hit Chaos, that means he'll just go to another side of the city, so you have to do is to keep hitting him in order to hit him. The final Chaos, the final Chaos fight in this one is just, was, is absolutely probably one of my favourite bo final boss fights, but I think his bo boss fight was a little bit better, it was uh, equally as fun in the Sonic Generations. Because that was a great boss fight. Right, so I've got 23 rings left, I've got to make this one count. Alright, here we go. Ooh. I do like this, uh, I do like this orchestrated uh, theme. I've got 10 rings left. I need to make this one. Do it. Can I do it? Can I do it? Yes! I got lifted up, but that hit his face, and I definitely got him. Ha <laughs> ha! And with that being said, we have finally finished Sonic Adventure! Oh, yes! My first 3D Sonic Let's Play has finally been done and dusted. Oh, the sadness theme again. I just think that's quite of a sad thing to see the sadness of poor chaos. Oh, the Chow! Chow believes in him. Because he was the guardian of the Chow. And seeing them die was pretty much what gave him the sorrow in his heart. Chaos has changed again. This this time for the better. That's right, yeah. Knuckles. Supersonic must have neutralized it, so it's nice again. Oh yeah. These are the Chow you were protecting. And that's Takao. Oh, there he is. There she is. They stayed alive for generations and now live peacefully with humans. The, the Chow live. The Chow are raised by humans and, of course, the Sonic cast in the first two Sonic Adventure games. The fighting's over. 
Harmony's restored and life goes on. If you want spinal spinning, I wish that were to happen in real life so that we can not live with anger so and hatred much. in this country. And he begs Sonic Tails and Knuckles for actually giving Chaos back his positive feelings, which is pretty good. Reaches out their hand for everything. And they watch on. Sonic watches Eggman go off again. Oh, that egg belly slyball never gives up. Now this is where I really start to really wonder what Tails is wondering on about. Big Simpson Father Gus for no reason. So does Amy and that pink birdie. All's well that ends well, right? I'll say it. I know so many people say it, and I'm gonna say it now. The Sorry. city's been fucking destroyed! But anyway, with that being said, we are finally done with Sonic Adventure. And Sonic goes off to his next adventure, which he runs off at. And this will all be continued in Sonic Adventure 2. But we'll do that in a... I'll do that in a later time. So, of course. And that is done for Sonic Adventure. Everything's all finished. And for once, we'll get on with the credits. And listen to Libin... Oh, yes. Li Open Your Heart once again is listening to... Oh, I still love this song. Well, probably one of Crush 40's best. And star director's Jun Sanu. I always saluted Jun Sanu. He is all, he's a fantastic musical genius in this game. Alright, with that being said, final thoughts of Sonic Adventure. Well, what can I say? I actually said that, have to say, for the first attempt of a 3D Sonic game, they actually did an incredible job. And I have to say, for an adventure element of getting varied gameplay styles, it actually does the job well. I loved Sonic the Hedgehog's... Sonic the Hedgehog's gameplay was fantastic. Tails' was also very good, but it could have had more levels. Knuckles' treasure hunting stages was, much more, was kept simple to the point. Amy's gameplay was slow, but thank god it only lasted three stages. Big shooting levels were pretty simple and straightforward and linear. And the less I say about Big's gameplay, the better. Well, of course, with that being said, most of the gameplay is mostly incredible, and I have to say it's done really well. As for the story, well, to be fairly honest, to get the sense of the story can be a bit of a lot of work, but to be fairly honest, I love loved how they were go what they were going for trying to stop chaos at all costs without actually being able to uh, b before they before it's all too late but of course I have to say for a story for the 3D Sonic game I have to say it was done rather well now for the graphical presentation I have to say this was actually based off the GameCube remake which was also the PC version which was a, which was something I absolutely liked the PC version actually was more high res than the one on the GameCube. Well, by technical standards, anyway. But with that, I, I liked how the graphics actually looked on the HD ports. But I don't. St but still, the animation and the mouth movements are still awkward as hell. Honestly, that was just bad. It's still quite bad. Uh, even though it was originally a Dreamcast title, though. So, yeah. As for the sound direction, the soundtrack was really awesome to hear, and I have to say they did really well with the amount of variants that they used in this game's soundtrack. And I have to say, Crush 40's Open Your Heart song was an absolute fantastic song to hear. I just love this song. <sighs> As for the voice acting for the first for the first ever main Sonic game to feel for to feature full voice acting, they actually did a decent job. Ryan's Romand was pretty good with Sonic. Tails' voice with Corey Briggers was actually pretty good, and I have to say, he is done a really good as a. His voice acting was pretty good, Tails' was. Knuckles' voice sounded. meh, best. Amy didn't really sound really that annoying as much as her Lisa or Tiz voice, though, but. As for first try for Amy, well done. Big's voice sounded too dopey, and why did they have to use John St. John? Ugh. 
Omega's voice sounded quite good as he had so much emo as he had too so much emotions and feelings about his about his robotic brothers. And as for Eggman, ah, oh, D. Bristow was a foil fantastic voice actor, and I can't believe it's been a decade since his passing. So with that being said, I still salute D. Bristow for actually being a great first choice for our first 3D Sonic game before four voice acting. In my final thoughts, I have to say this right now, Sonic Adventure is still a game you can play, pick up a play, and go through all the stories just to make sense. And as for the gameplay styles, it's a real fun game. Aside from Amy and big stories. But honestly, I have to say, Sonic Adventure for a game has aged quite well, and I have to say, it is still recommendable to play. And as you can probably tell, I still love it. But then again, in order to see what's going to happen next time, we've got Sonic Adventure 2 next to do. Oh yeah. So with that being said, I'll, this has been Mitch McKidd signing out saying goodnight. Thank you for joining, peace out, and I'll see you guys in my next Let's Play.